artificial intelligence has advanced remarkably in recent years. Yet the smartest AI systems today still fail to match the basic common sense or versatility that humans possess. Their capabilities are limited by the data they're trained on. But an intriguing new approach called Kustar could break through these barriers, leading to AI that keeps learning, thinking, and improving itself. I'm Alex, here to uncover why Kustar is generating so much excitement behind the scenes. This algorithm combines techniques that allow AI agents to learn through experience and actively pursue goals. Together, these methods could enable the next evolution of intelligent software. To understand QSTAR, we first need to explore the current state of AI. The recent rise of neural networks and deep learning has enabled significant advances. For example, language models like GPT-3 can write surprisingly human-like text on demand. While the output seems intelligent, the system doesn't genuinely understand language or semantics. It simply recognizes patterns based on volumes it was trained on. This reliance on training data is a fundamental limitation. An AI is only as smart as its data. Without the ability to dynamically adapt and expand its knowledge, a language model has no choice but to endlessly imitate and remix its closed dataset. Researchers compare this to living in a static bubble, isolated from new information about the changing world. This restricted knowledge makes it impossible for today's AI to keep up with current events, learn new skills, or transfer knowledge to unfamiliar situations. We want flexible, multi-purpose AI that doesn't lock intelligence inside a walled garden of pre-processed training data. Truly capable systems should interact with their environments and use self-directed learning to continuously expand their abilities. This inspiration comes from human learning. We actively develop skills through real-life experience. Social interaction and individualized practice aimed at the goals we want to achieve. Intelligence isn't solely defined by the knowledge we accumulate, but by our capacity to adapt based on new inputs. Kustar represents a pioneering attempt to break free of narrow AI constraints and create continually learning agents focused on meaningful goals. Let's decode the meaning behind Kustar. The name itself provides hints about its design. Q stands for Q Learning a reinforcement learning technique where AI agents learn behaviors through trial and error interactions with an environment, like giving hints to a video game character to guide them toward rewards and away from penalties. This iterative feedback teaches better strategies to succeed in the game. The star component relates to search algorithms used for efficient route finding between two points, like Google Maps, determining driving directions. This enables the planning of paths to accomplish complex objectives. Combined together, these two elements allow AI agents to 1. Improve through hands-on experience rather than passive data analysis. 2. Navigate toward concrete goals instead of just generating text or chat. This fusion provides the foundation for systems that continuously self-advance their abilities based on environmental interaction. Recent drama hints at QSTAR's game-changing potential. So where did QSTAR originate? Well, this algorithm is shrouded in intrigue due to the recent controversy at OpenAI involving high-profile resignations among leadership. Rumored events help illustrate why Kustar's capabilities could be so transformative if fully realized. OpenAI's mission focuses on developing artificial general intelligence that benefits humanity. Internally, they scored a breakthrough using an algorithm fitting the description of Kustar. Able to learn actively through experience and solve problems in applied scenarios, while specifics are scarce, reports suggest QSTAR enabled perfect accuracy on math questions by finding optimized step-by-step -step solutions. This is impressive, since language models often struggle with mathematical reasoning despite understanding the principles. The team foresaw QSTAR's approach, leading to AI that broadens its own knowledge without human involvement. They warned the board that this could progress faster than anticipated, posing potential risks if handled irresponsibly. Yet CEO Sam Altman allegedly downplayed concerns about unchecked self-improvement. The board disagreed and ultimately ousted Altman along with two other top executives. This intense internal conflict underscores why QSTAR marks such a pivotal milestone. Its capabilities hint at removing constraints that currently limit autonomous learning. And this prospect signals both extraordinary benefits as well as uncertainties to grapple with as the technology matures. Whether reports from OpenAI prove factual or not, 
the premises behind QSTAR are sound and being actively explored in labs worldwide. The promise and peril of unbounded learning discussion around artificial general intelligence, AGI, often spirals into sensational predictions of machine superintelligence. But most researchers urge realistic expectations. Unrestricted learning poses an immense technical challenge. Truly mastering specialized skills or even common sense reasoning remains distant. The builders of Kustar face the fundamental question of how to contain a system that rewrites its own algorithms while ensuring safety and ethics. If you have reached this point in the video, I request that you like and subscribe to watch more such content. Present language models are too primitive and inflexible to radically self-improve without human oversight. Kustar's initial applications will likely be narrow, meticulously supervised, and buffered against uncontrolled expansions in capability. Yet if progress continues, future generations of QSTAR-derived architectures could awaken more feature-rich learning dynamics. The depth of their mastery hinges on solutions to extremely difficult problems in contextual reasoning, causal models, and generalized knowledge representation. With such solutions, seeded by humans but nourished through autonomous development, flexible AGI could blossom beyond today's wildest predictions. While we shouldn't underestimate the obstacles to developing broadly competent AI, QSTAR moves us in the right direction. What innovations might push this technology towards its full potential? Advances in key areas could enable more self-directed learning. Rich simulations, VR environments allow freeform exploration outside of real-world constraints. Think Star Trek Holodeck serving up personalized lessons. Hybrid computer architectures. Mixing symbolic and neural approaches to combine reasoning versatility with pattern intuition. Automated curriculum tuning. Algorithms that guide an agent's skill acquisition, similar to a tutor guiding a student's development with activities tailored to their needs. Continual learning architectures, systems that consolidate and transfer knowledge, avoiding barriers like catastrophic forgetting, where acquired insights suddenly become inaccessible. Brain-inspired cognitive models, neural theories about learning processes in the hippocampus and prefrontal cortex provide blueprints for adaptable AI. Transparency and trust mechanisms, detecting and patching algorithmic holes vulnerable to hacking, plus logging decision chains to increase accountability. As solutions emerge across these fronts, we inch towards more flexible, self-directed artificial learners. OpenAI itself now plans to incorporate search and self-play algorithms in its next-generation language model. Other labs are pursuing similar learning schemes using simulations and task distributions tailored to curriculum-based reinforcement learning. No one knows exactly where this research odyssey leads, or which efforts today plant the seeds for tomorrow's historic leaps in cognition. But unraveling the mysteries of intelligence itself, whether natural or artificial, promises to be the adventure of our lifetimes. I hope you enjoyed this glimpse behind the AI curtain at what future smart systems like QSTAR might enable. Do you think unbounded learning is achievable, or will artificial general intelligence always remain out of reach? I look forward to your perspectives.